Well, let's recap some of the amazing looks from last night's Met Gala. Alisa Frederico, the style director at Dressing Jane, is here. Mm -hmm. Good morning. So, first of all, the theme, and you are very on theme, Carl <laughs> Lagerfeld, right? That's right, droopy mm -hmm. bows and, and tweed and boucle. Mm -hmm. and, and high collars. Yes. The high collar. Mm -hmm. oh, it's Penelope. Uh, it, it looked like Penelope Cruz was getting married. Well, she, you know, her and Dua Lipa actually both yeah. were wearing uh, things that were inspired inspired by Chanel in the 90s, and this was part of a bridal kind of vibe that they were going oh. for. The hood, to me, was amazing and outrageous, and I absolutely loved it. Gorgeous. And they were yeah. both co-hosts, right? Yes, co-chairs. Yep. Co-chairs, thank you. Okay, my favorite, Janelle Monet. First of all, I, I love well, her. Well, we're missing with. one. Oh, oh, Rihanna was there. <laughs> yes, Rihanna. And she came late. I'm surprised people were still at the red. It was like after, what, 9? It was after 9 o'clock, and it's funny, because if you saw the press, they were all sitting there literally just waiting so she didn't even get to the carlisle until after six o'clock she shows up she leaves in a fendi fur coat and then she arrives in this amazing rosette cocoon by valentino and then she takes it off at one point and there's a reveal absolutely Look at that. Oh, sweet and i love that yeah. she says i'm expensive when she walks by mm -hmm. <laughs> it looks really good we love reveals on that carpet i like dressy women i yeah. Wait, did you guys notice actually her sunglasses with the eyelashes? Yes. Down? I love that there was a little whimsy feel to her vibe also. Certainly was. Another reveal on the red carpet with Janelle Monae. <laughs> reveal, 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 reveal. It kept spinning. This was amazing. I mean, you know, again, I know you love her, Mike. She oh, she never disappoints us with kind of the theatrics, and I love this. This was the first time that, you know, underneath there in that crinoline, there was a swimsuit on the stairs. So it keeps But it, had, it was like three different outfits because it's the first layer. This one. And yes. then I thought, okay, so there's the next look. Yeah. And then they keep going. <laughs> <laughs> and going and again she those those ties are kind of propped up to look like they're flying off of her head i just it was fun and it was whimsy and it was the drama that we were looking for come because, on fellas hurry up yeah it's like go a little faster but you up. know it was so demure in the beginning of yes. of the carpet and then it started getting a little more exciting with um, and it finishes kind of, off with a sexy swimsuit it's a swimsuit mm -hmm. so again first yeah. time in the history that they're showing a swimsuit on the stairs mm -hmm. and then florence Pugh loved um florence Pugh again revealing this crew cut she worked with valentino also she's the face of their new ad campaign so it's no surprise that she's dressed by them but i love this it was it, this beautiful dress on the bottom but then her really great um crew cut and that floral headpiece on top or feather headpiece on top which look at again, that <laughs> wait someone asked how did you fit that in the car and she said no, no i didn't it, <laughs> it was in the trunk exactly <laughs> most people get dressed actually in the holding area when they do arrive because this is so you know how, how do you transport that yeah there's no way how long did it take little nonsense X to get ready. I mean, I would love to know. God. He is taking the naked trend to the next yes. level. I'm, I, I don't really understand what this had to do with he loves Karl Lagerfeld. To, well, I, I guess a he modern is cat, a modern yeah. cat for Chopet, but I, I don't know. I think this might be my Halloween costume. I'm really <laughs> loving it. Well, but this I don't is, have the body for that. But mm, This is a thong and all body paint, glitter, and jewels, and that's it. And the heels. Look yeah. All right, keeping with wow. the cat, Doja Cat, um, rocking the cat. We saw lots of different cats out there for Chopin. But she won the cats. I mean, well, yeah. Jared Leto was pretty cool, yeah. too. But look at this. This is amazing. This was 350,000 sea glass beads all over that wow. dress. 5,000 hours of manpower to put this together. But look what they did with her face. Yeah, so the prosthetic nose. I, I love it. She brought it. She gave us. I mean, how, how gorgeous is this? Wow. Again, the drama and the theatrics that we were looking for. Were the Jenners there? The Kardashians? That whole crew? Uh, yeah, I love that the rumor was that they weren't invited. Yeah. Come on, let's let's be real. Look at that. Um, I loved, actually, Kendall was dressed by Marc Jacobs. And what I really loved about hers is the cape was a big thing on the carpet last night. But her cape was actually the sleeves to that bodysuit. I love that. Oh, and that then nice. Mark Jacobs, those Kiki boots. Anyone sitting at his table and dressed by him, so they're called Kiki boots, they'll be sold out by this morning, I'm sure. Every single person had a pair of those boots on. Okay, we have about six more. We only have a time for maybe two. Let's pick somebody out of this okay. next that's, list. Well, it's too bad, honey, because I like the back okay. of it. And we don't usually do men, and men are usually boring, and he's not. Yeah. He is not boring. Oh, my God, the cascading floral. Again, it, his, his cape is sleeve details. But he didn't arrive with his lady friend, that's for one. But he looked absolutely amazing. There's yes. no back. Yes. yes, that's amazing. That's that's pretty daring, honestly, for a man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then um, Cardi B, I liked hers as well. Looked like she had two looks, but she, this was the second one on the right carpet. Three. She oh, left wow. the hotel in one. She arrived and put this Chad Peng dress on, and then the after party, she had a whole other look. Also, I mean, not the after party, the actual seated dinner party upstairs had another look. Um, but she looks amazing, and she was hilarious because when she said, "Ooh, I have spent so much money at Chanel, so I'm glad to be here." I, I just love her whole vibe. She's like a little Barbie doll over there. Okay. That's gorgeous. And the true star of the show, I think, would have to be this per I mean, it had to be this moment. Papa Roach? <laughs> oh, my gosh. 
Do you see that? That's the mascot of New York City. What are you talking about? It's only right that he made an appearance on that carpet. He's like, don't shut me out of this event. Yeah. But it was funny because people were directing him to, you know, oh, no, go this way, like as if the cockroach is listening, how to right. get off the carpet. They oh, the designer was Jiminy. Oh. Uh, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you, guys. Kelly's classroom, that's where